right, so I'm back, and today we're going to take a look at the G1 Scavenger. Uh, so here he is in his vehicle mode. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, again, you know, construction vehicle. Uh, he does have this stupid thing here. This actually gets in the way. Um, so not as much playability as I would say the Bone Crusher was because, you know, unless this is all the way down, it's not going to really fit on there. Uh, so he's got the... This attachment, I think, I don't really know. It's either this one or this one that's supposed to go with him. Doesn't really matter. We also got the drill, just like that. And of course, the hand. So, yeah, let's we'll just set that off to the side. He does. Uh, with his gun, which it looks like you can plug into the top there. I don't know if the rest can do that, but yeah. Uh, yeah, that's not much to him. Uh, no wheels on the treads, which is fine. Uh, this does rotate left and right, so you get a good range of motion there. You got some nice chrome going. Um, this has a hinge here and here, so you can, you know, yeah, I'm imagining, you know, five-year-old me playing with this in the sand castles, you know, at school or whatever, and having a blast, you know. Um, yeah, other than that, there's not a whole lot to them. Uh, so you want to fold this up, fold the feet down, or the legs, I guess, and then the feet will rotate out. Like that. I just don't want to see him to stay tabbed in. That's not cool. There we go. And then you can fold the arms out. Just like that. Head comes up. And there you go. So let me give him a pistol. Yeah. Uh, not a lot to him, again, like the rest of them. Uh, Posability, his arm does swivel. Uh, legs are again attached, uh, much like uh, um, Bone Crusher, but at least these ones fold forward rather than back, so you can kind of do something with them. Feet do swivel. Um, be careful with those. With these, like I said, they have a tendency of popping off. Um, other than that, not a lot to them. Um, Comparison here he is with Bone Crusher and Scavenger or Scraper S Screamer Thundercracker. Um, yeah, uh, all in all, I mean, he is he's better than Bone Crusher. That's that's you know, that's a given. Um, can't get much worse than Bone Crusher, really. Um, not quite as good as Scrapper, but he's pretty good. Um, for what he is, for his time frame, I'd probably give him a 6 out of 10. Um, he's still pretty good. He does have his flaws. He doesn't, he's a little back heavy. and He just, not quite screen accurate, but, uh, but still, like I said, better than Bone Crusher. So, um, so yeah, I guess that's really all there is.